Good morning, friends. Today is Tuesday. You might notice that I am filming this in a different spot than usual. I'm inside my tent. <laughs> um, I think most of you know I was supposed to go camping this weekend, and since we're staying at home, um, I couldn't do that. So um, I decided that we were going to put up my tent in my living room, and I haven't taken it down yet. <laughs> so <laughs> I thought today I could film for you inside from inside my tent. <laughs> All right. So let's take some deep breaths. Ready? Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out. Last one, breathe in, breathe out. All right, I'm gonna pick a song for us to sing. This one says, the wheels on the bus. And I think I have our little visual for that. Let me find it. Oh, here it is. The wheels on the bus. All right. You guys ready? The wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round all through the town the driver on the bus says move on back move on back move on back the driver of the bus says move on back all through the town the doors on the bus go open and shut open and shut open and shut the doors on the bus go open and shut all through the town the horn on the bus goes beep 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 the horn on the bus goes beep 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 all through the town the windows on the bus go up and down up and down, up and down, the windows on the bus go up and down, all through the town. The babies on the bus go whir, 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 whir. the babies on the bus go whir, 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 all through the town. The wipers on the bus go swish, 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 swish. The wipers on the bus go swish, 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 all through the town. The wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round, all through the town. All right, so my friends, I'm gonna do, we're gonna read a story, an online story. And this story, let me go back to the beginning, is called Animal Homes. So we're all at home, um, whatever your home looks like, whether it's an apartment or a house, maybe a townhouse, um, you're at home, and let's see what these animals' homes look like. Okay, so that says animal homes. And here it has a little vocabulary tree. So these are words that they're going to use in this story. So we have, this says animals. Bee, bird, bat, fox, deer, bear, spider, and rabbit. These are different words for animal homes. Hive, nest, cave, den, web, burrow. Okay, so think about all of those different vocabulary words while we're reading this story. Here on the bottom, it says, animals need a place to live. Some animals build their homes, like these bees. 
bees build a what? Do you remember that vocabulary word? That's right, a hive. Bees build a hive. Birds use grass and twigs. Do you remember what a bird's house home is called? A nest. Birds use grass and twigs. They make a nest. Remember, friends, we've been seeing the um, red-tailed hawks at our school that were building a nest that we could see from like far, far away. <laughs> could always see them with a little piece of grass or twigs in their beaks. Other animals find their homes. So those first two animals made their homes. These animals find their homes. Like these bats. Some bats sleep in caves. They hang on to the rocks. And what's funny about the way they sleep? That's right, they're upside down. Can you imagine sleeping upside down? Some homes are low. A fox lives in a den. It's in the ground. It says down here, foxes often make their dens near the base of a tree. Hmm, I wonder why. What do you think, friends? I honestly have no idea. <laughs> mm, some homes are high. Like this bald eagle. A bird lives in a nest. It's up in a tree. Some animals sleep in many homes. Deer walk all day. Then they find a new place to rest. So they don't stay in the same place every night. They go to different places. Other animals sleep in one home all the time. Some bears sleep in a den and they sleep there all winter. Do you guys remember what that's called? That's right, hibernating. Bears are one of the animals that hibernate. Some homes are for one animal. A spider lives on a web. It lives alone. Look at how cool the patterns on that spider are. So beautiful. Other homes are for animal families. Rabbits live together. They live in a burrow. So you can see that that burrow is kind of underground. You can see over here, there's the grass and stuff that's outside, but they are underneath the dirt. They've made a little home for themselves in a burrow. There are many kinds of homes. Some even move. <laughs> like this hermit crab carries its um, home on its back or its home is around it and it moves with it everywhere it goes. Okay, so here it says, your turn. Match each animal to its home. So let's see, number one is a spider. Does a spider live in a hive, a nest, a burrow, or a web? That's right, a web. How about rabbits? Do rabbits, um, is a rabbit's home a hive, a nest, a burrow, or a web? That's right, it's a burrow. All right, friends, it just got really loud outside. Someone's doing some work outside. Um, all right, next we have a bee. Is a bee's home a hive, a nest, a burrow, or a web? Hmm, that's right, a hive. All right, last one, a bird. Is a bird's home a hive, a nest, a burrow, or a web? That's right, a nest. And all right, my friends. <laughs> Thanks for reading with me. Um, tomorrow, stay tuned. We have a special guest reader going to be reading tomorrow. Um, so you'll have to wait and see who that is. <laughs> I love you. I miss you. I'll see you soon.